What up, y'all? This is your boy Ace here, and welcome to After News Delight. So, um, in the last video, I talked about how Solo Sokoa attacked Elias after the match and did the spike thumb. He, uh, you know, remember last week he uh, did a salute to his late uncle, uh, Umaga, who passed away, I believe, last Sunday, not yesterday, Sunday, but last Sunday, uh, 13 years ago in 2009. So, he did a salute to him the day after his death um, and stuff like that. So I went over that. I went over all that in a previous video. We're going to talk about Kevin Owens here, so let's just get right into it. So after Solo, Sokoa tried to get, basically tried to do the same thing that he did to Matt Riddle the week before, crippling the man. He was about to do it to Elias, and then that's when Kevin Owens came out. Earlier, we saw Kevin Owens with Elias. Elias had interrupted his interview with Kathy Kelly backstage. And uh, basically, Elias, you know, was saying that it was Ezekiel. It wasn't him. His brother Ezekiel was the one that attacked him earlier in the year. And Kevin Owens just wasn't, he wasn't accepting of it. So he thinks that Elias did it. He thinks, we, you know, this is a different version of Elias or whatever. So he's not buying that. So, but Kevin Owens still didn't want to see the bloodline. And he, he, he still has unfinished business with the bloodline. And so... He was uh, in a position to save Elias at that point, and he did. Came out with the um, cheer and basically tried to get uh, him, uh, Solo Sokoa and Sami Zayn out of the ring. Sami Zayn was telling Solo, "That's enough." You know, we, you know, he was telling Solo, "That's enough." You know, you you sent the message. You know what I'm saying? You did a good job sending the message. We, you know, we need to leave this alone for the rest of the night. And uh, on they went. So. Um, I forgot to mention in the last video as well that Roman Reigns is supposed to be in Chicago for SmackDown on Friday. So, it's going to be very interesting. They're supposed to be uh, celebrating the honorary Ooh Sami Zayn. So, we'll see how that goes on Friday night. Definitely going to report it on this channel. So, definitely make sure y'all come back. But, yeah, Kevin Owens uh, says Elias there uh, uh, from Trouble from Solo. And I've been loving the way they've been using Solo the, over the past week. Just attacking folks and sending people to the upper rooms to the gulags and everything like that. Uh, but I knew, I, I had a feeling uh, Kevin Owens was coming out, though. I had a feeling that they wasn't going to have Elias Cripple 2 uh, in the corner like that. So, But I, like I was saying in the last video, I cannot wait to see Kevin Owens versus Solo Sokol in a match. I've been wanting to see that ever since War Games. I'm glad it looks like they're hitting in that direction with those two. Just two badasses, and I, and I like it because... It seems like it's evenly split. It doesn't seem like it's one of those, you know, where one of the two guys doesn't look like they should should be in a ring with the other one. Like, it looks like they're both on the same level. So, I'm definitely liking that. But going ahead and get this video a like, y'all. Hit the like button for me. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel, especially if you're new in the zoo. Any comments y'all got, definitely put them below. And if you want to donate to the channel, hit the super thanks button below, guys. I much appreciate it. But, yeah, I cannot wait to see these two in a match, man. It's going to be very exciting to watch that. Can't wait to continue to, continue to see the beef between these two. Um, I hope to see a little bit more between Solo Sokoa and Kevin Owens physically and, uh, before they had this match. I don't know when they're going to have this match because it's such a long ways away for the next pay-per-view, which is the World Rumble. We, World Rumble is at the end of January, so we don't have any because they canceled day one, which was going to be on New Year's night. We don't, you know, we don't have. So basically, they may fight each other on Raw. I don't know, but you know, or SmackDown. But we'll see, we'll see. But thank you guys for watching this video. After news, delight.